The next time you see wild salmon on a menu, it might be tamer than you think. According to a new study from Oceana, 43% of salmon it sampled from restaurants and grocery stores was mislabeled. The group said often salmon marketed as wild or Alaskan is actually farmed. The study also found restaurant salmon was more likely to be mislabeled than salmon bought in the grocery store. A superhero is patrolling the streets of Beaverton, Oregon. He calls himself the Guardian Shield. By day, he works a regular job, but at night, he puts on his costume and goes on patrol. The Shield also carries pepper spray, a stun gun, first aid kit, and GoPro camera. Beaverton police say they don't encourage people to step into dangerous situations, but appreciate the Shield and others who tell them about trouble. This was National Cat Day, and to celebrate, Uber offered a special kitten delivery service across 55 cities. For $30, callers could have a kitten delivered for 15 minutes of cuddle time. Customers had to be pre-screened to make sure their homes were secure and they didn't have a cat allergy. The annual event has led to the adoption of several kittens. Retailers say some of the most popular Halloween costumes this year are ripped from the headlines. Cecil the Lion is a big hit and of course a lot of people will go out dressed as Donald Trump. Other top sellers, the New York Pizza Rat and The Dress, based on a picture on the internet that went viral when people couldn't decide if a certain dress was black and blue or white and gold. A cow in North Dakota may have the best Halloween costume nature could make. This heifer doesn't have an official name, but the marking on her head sort of says it all. A lot of people have been dropping by the farm to see the cow born with a skull design on her forehead. There you go, five things to know before you go to bed.